Wilkinson's rivals, W.W. Greener, however, saw potential and believed it could be a great commercial success. The company also had access to a surplus supply of old French Model 1874 Gras rifle bayonets, which would be converted into pistol bayonets relatively easily and cost-effectively. The top 10.5 inches of the Gras bayonet was cut off and was then fixed to a gunmetal hilt shaped to fit the Webley's frame. The bayonet's clever design meant it connected perfectly to the revolver. However, its one-pound weight would have meant that the balance of the revolver was compromised. Ultimately, W.W. Greener only produced 200 copies, and Pritchard's bayonet never officially entered service, even though officers were allowed to purchase it privately for their own personal use. Despite its negligible use in combat, the design was nonetheless both radical and impressive. 